So if you're if you're young and you lose your hair, that's one thing versus you're old and you lose your hair versus losing the color of your hair. It's all different pieces and parts of this puzzle. Um, so if you are young and you're losing your hair, it's probably genetic. And then you're sort of semi screwed. If you're old and you're losing your hair and it's the male pattern balding, it's a cross between um, hormonal issues, blood flow in the scalp and, and a variety of other things. Because if you PRP, um, the bald spot, as you are balding, you can actually recover a lot of the hair loss. So we know it's reversible. It's just a matter of what is it that we are reversing and does it need to be topical or can it be oral? Interestingly enough, there's something called a clonia cava, which is a seaweed from Japan. And it's known to make your hair grow faster and better. Um, which is kind of cool. How it does that exactly, I don't know, but it does and studies have proven that it does. Um, additionally, so in terms of color, color can be one of two things. Color comes from a melanocyte stem cells. Um, how, to, how to phrase this? One of two things either happen, either the melanocyte stem cell stops making melanocytes and this for stops making color, or the hair gets bleached from within because you get a development of catalase in your cells. That's not true. You get a development of hydrogen peroxide in your cells and catalase gets rid of it and turns it into oxygen and water. But if you have a catalase deficiency, you're gonna bleach your hair before it grows out. So you're gonna look gray. So you're either gray because you've got stem cell problem or you have a catalase deficiency both of which you can kind of help by the entire program. So a lot of the things I talk about aren't gonna be specifically for your hair, but they're going to help all of your cells in general and therefore your hair will benefit by association. I don't have a magical shampoo if that's what you're asking for. A Colonia Cava, I, I take it orally, um, but it does come, they put it in creams frequently and you can smear it on yourself. I think there's actually an Colonia Cava shampoo, I think. Uh, I've never used it. I think I've seen it advertised, but yes, I guess there is a magic shampoo. Uh, I don't know if it works or not. I've never tried. I have, I have no firsthand evidence of that, but I do take a clonia cava and I do have damn good hair, which may or may not be correlated. I have no idea.